Hey there, this is Vanessa DeBerle and welcome to my channel, Affiliate Marketing Mastery, Learn to Earn a Passive Income and Do It Guilt-Free. All right, today we're gonna learn three tools that you need for email marketing. We've talked a lot about how emails marketing is crucial to your online business and your affiliate marketing business. You have to have an email list. What are the tools that you need to use to put that system into place? And that's what we're gonna go over today. The first tool that you need is an autoresponder. Now I have two here that I like to use. One is called Active Campaign. Active Campaign is really nice because it automates your campaign or your sequence. And it thinks for you, if that makes sense. Um, it's It has really good deliverability rates and very easy to use and it automates and this is what i mean by automate so if you set up your sequence you you will set up each step like i want to send out this email um, there are certain times of the day that i want it to go out what happens is you're going to have some people that will buy what you have offered them and that will swing them over here and take them out of the sequence and maybe put them in a different sequence because now they've become buyers and then you have over here where the system will even re-deliver it, maybe at a different time until that person opens it. So it's automated. You don't have to think, you don't have to go in, you don't have to separate anything. So I want you to connect Active Campaign with the word automation because it's very, very good at doing that. Now, another one that I like to use is called Action Edics. Action Edics is actually part of the ClickFunnels software. ClickFunnels has a software where you can create funnels, home pages. Um, sales pages, landing pages, all kinds of things. Well, within that software program, they have an autoresponder called Action Edics. The reason I like that one is it's a one-stop shop. Everything you need is right there in the same software. So it's really up to you what you're looking for. If you're looking for both, maybe you have two different types of lists and maybe you want some of it automated, some of it to be in a one-stop shop, or if you prefer one over the other, it's up to you. But I have both links below. You can look at both of them. They both have trial periods and you can check them out and see which is best for you. You definitely need to have an auto responder. I do not recommend going with a free one because they're not gonna give you many options. You're gonna build this, um, your email marketing system into that free account, and then you're gonna find that it's not doing what you need, and then you have to take the time to move it. So I say start with a good one in the beginning, learn it, use it, and that saves you a lot of time in the end. If you're serious about your business, if you're just playing around, maybe go to the free one. All right, and then this is called glockapps.com, and what it does is you can put your email in there and glockapps.com will test it. It will test it for um, deliverability. If, for instance, it will say, yeah, if you send it out the way it is, 97% of those will go in an in inbox. Um, there's some that will go to a tab and then you want to see if it's going to go to spam. So if you're new, you may find that you may be using words that are spammy and that uh, Glock apps will tell you that like you're these are things this is going to be a spammy email you might not want to use it and you can go in and tweak it and edit it it's also going to do a content analysis for you and tell you things like um if you do have a lot of words in there that you need to change um it might tell you that hey yes this looks like it's a you're a spammer and you don't want to look like that or maybe you are a spammer and you're, you you don't want to look like one um and it also will test your subject line um in there so it's pretty much a tester app and it's free so definitely check that out um one more thing that i have i'm going to pull that one up live let's go ahead and pull it up this one's pretty cool um it's called subjectline.com and you can test one subject line of your email per day. Now, if you wanna test more, a lot of people like to batch their um, emails. They like to do a few at once. Um, go to an incognito window and test it in there or use it again in there and it won't pick up on your computer. So let's test the one that we're using here. So I haven't even tested it. Three tools you need for email marketers now if this comes up that it's not a good one i'm going to change it um, um actually this would be the subject line of a, an email but you could still put that in there um this is a video if i wanted to share this video with my um, as a broadcast in my email marketing i could do that and use the same headline let's see what it works i don't know what okay there we go we're going to evaluate and see what happens 
it's a negative nine. So even though it might be good for YouTube, it may not be the best thing. It says there's no cap capitalization detected. Okay, that can be fixed. Uh, it has more than eight characters, does not contain a sense of urgency. Um, you use the word you or your, that's good. And it contains a number, that's good. So uh, it contains a non-round number, like 311 or 24, and that's eight points. So it's kind of cool. It's telling me what I did well and what I didn't do well. And let's go down a little bit more. Good job, your subject line is close to meeting all industry standards. So I can go back in, I can tweak that if I'm using it in my email subject line, make sure I use my capitalization. See, I just typed it in real quick and make sure that I put some kind of a sense of urgency in there to make it better. So any subject line, you can go in there and test them for free. So what did we just go over? We went over one, you need an, an autoresponder, two, use glockapps.com and three subjectline.com. Those are three tools that will definitely help you get started. Um, and before you go, uh, make sure the links for the autoresponders are below. Um, and I've also put the free sites for Glock apps and subject line as well, right there. Go ahead and take a snapshot so you can write those down and subscribe to my channel. Give me a thumbs up if this was helpful and I'll see you on the next video.